Hi, I'm Shamil Valabji, sports scientist and running expert. Welcome to Sports Science. Today on Sports Science, I'm going to help you understand why you're getting injured. At the Heal Institute, I'm lucky enough to analyze over 650 runners every single month. And I have found three common mistakes in all their training methodologies. The first one is the principle of progressive overload. It simply states, do not increase your weekly training mileage or your training intensity by more than 10% weekly. For example, if you run 30 kilometers in a week, the next week, your weekly training mileage should not increase by more than 33 kilometers. If you are lifting 10 kgs on a particular exercise, the weight the following week should not be more than 11 kgs. If you stick to this rule, you will most likely not get a chronic injury. The second rule is the principle of specific training, which means that you need to train specifically for what you want to achieve. If you want to get faster, your training needs to match that. If you want to get build endurance, your training needs to match that. For example, people who want to get faster, sprint training and interval training are fantastic examples to help build that speed. And if you want to build endurance, you have to spend more time on the road. That's the only way you're going to build your mileage and get those legs stronger for those endurance runs. The third and most important principle is the principle of recovery. Remember, recovery is probably the most neglected component of training. There are three factors in recovery, nutrition, hydration, and sleep. If you tick these three boxes, you're probably going to be well on your way to recovering, which is going to be the key to performance enhancement. These three tips are the secret to reducing your running related injuries. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel. Sports Science is going to be bringing you many, many more videos on running tips and training drills. I'm going to see you soon.